One needs a complete overview of the energy transition when you do project development. And how Aberwind is doing this, we will learn in this video. Mr. Svetochowski, what distinguishes Abowind from other project developers? There are essentially uh, three things. Um, we were already founded in 1996, so 27 years ago. Um, this makes us some kind of pioneers in the en uh, renewable energy sector. And uh, during all these past years, we developed a lot of uh, new wind projects, solar projects, battery storage projects with a huge pipeline. Um, and uh, currently, um, we can offer to our investors um, turnkey solutions for PV plants, for example, but also hybrid and wind projects. And we can also offer uh, fully permitted projects. So we have a lot in portfolio. And of course, we can also uh, help investors to find the very attractive financing products for uh, such projects. So when we talk to the investors, they are fully permitted projects, they are turnkey built projects and also financing all in one package. They, they like these solutions. Okay. Um, what is your contribution to the energy transition as a middle-sized company? So in the 27 years of our existence, we have developed projects with a volume of five gigawatts and two gigawatts has been built. And this uh, make a huge contribution to CO2 uh, savings. So we um, avoid uh, emission of more than uh, two million tons of uh, dioxide carbon per year with uh, all our projects that has been built. Um, now we have a 1,000 employees in uh, our 16 countries where we are acting and um, we developed a uh, huge project. Uh, we have 21 gigawatts on uh, wind, solar and battery projects. We have additionally 20 gigawatts uh, on projects for green hydrogen. So um, I think Really, this is a massive volume on, on new projects and uh, with this contribution, we will positively um, contribute, of course, to the to avoid the, the climate change transition. and to the energy transition. Exactly. Okay. Yeah. Do you have a typical example for a solar project you are just developing for us? Um, yes, I have. Uh, in Val de Zorita, in the La Mancha region in Spain, we are on track to build now uh, 50 megawatts projects next year. So now we are very um, busy with the planning, with the last execution planning for this project and soon the project will start in Spain. So we are very proud to collaborate, of course, with our local team in Spain. We have an office in Valencia and um, we have a very knowledgeable engineers there. Uh, additionally, they get uh, support from uh, our headquarters in Wiesbaden, so this is really very good um, uh, collaboration. Um, also, this project will, of course, contribute to avoid the CO2 emission. And additionally, we will positively um, restore the area there. Um, the curiosity of this site is that in the neighborhood there was um, a nuclear power in the past and uh, this uh, nuclear power has been completely dismantled and now we built a new PV plan, renewable energies. Um, this all sounds very very smooth, no problems at all. Are there any hurdles you have to face? Yeah, of there? course, like, like each project developer, like each uh, the um, PV uh, turnkey provider, we face challenges and of course the permitting of such project is not easy. You know, I compare ourselves sometimes, not only because we are in this region of La Mancha, maybe you remember Don Quixote of course, fight yeah. once or the, also against the, the windmills. Mi windmills <laughs> exactly. So we, we feel this way too sometimes and yeah, it is yeah. not easy of course, but we have a very no knowledgeable staff. 
All right. So you always get permission in the end. In Val de Zorita, we are fully permitted already, so right. we know we will start early next year. All right. What markets are you focusing on with Abowind in the future? Currently, um, Abowind is acting in 16 countries. Uh, in Ireland and in Finland, we are focusing on wind energy, but in all the remaining 14 markets, we are offering all the technologies, means wind, photovoltaic, hybrid system with battery storage, battery storage standalone. And as I told you before, we are looking into digging deeper to the um, green hydrogen sources. So we will focus on all these energies in this remaining 14 countries. And who knows, maybe in the future we will add some new country too, if there's opportunity for Abo Wind. Of and maybe some new technology, who knows? Who knows? <laughs> who the knows? world is developing very fast. You have seen so many developers here and new products in the trade show. So yeah, I think there will be something great. new yeah. also coming yeah. soon. Yeah. Great. Thank you very much. Thank you too. And um, yeah, enjoy your trade fair. It was a pleasure. Thank okay. you very much again. Yeah. For me too. Okay. Yes, thank you. <laughs>